Hello Capricorn, welcome to your love reading. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Capricorn in this reading will be focusing on your new person. So it might be someone with whom you're currently in touch with, you are interested in this person, you might be dating this individual. For some of you Capricorn, it might be about your current connection, relationship. So please take it how it resonates. And of course, if you don't have your spe special person, Capricorn, you can take this reading as a prediction. Okay, so let's see. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Let's see what do we have for you. Mm hmm oh, okay so Capricorn we are connecting today in this reading for you with someone who is full of hope that uh, this connection uh, will reach its the highest of potentials okay you might be dealing with Aquarius I also have here a very strong Scorpio for some of you um, <laughs> You might be dealing here with someone who is quite mysterious, who is difficult to read. You might feel that there are very, very many layers to this person and to this connection. But things going to change. And I feel that things going to change for the better. Okay. This is someone who sees a window of opportunities regarding this connection. They are ready for this adventure. Uh, however for some of you there might be physical distance between the two of you okay it might be a long distance thing long distance connection relationship you know situationship but this person here is convinced that they are on the right path that 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 everything will be okay between the two of you That everything is hidden in the right direction. Let's see Capricorn. Show me more please. We have Page of Cups, Page of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, Eight of Cups. There might be physical distance between the two of you. Emperor, Ace of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, and the Lovers. Wow, okay, strength at the bottom of the deck. So Capricorn, you might be dealing with Aries. We have Gemini and Leo so far in this reading for you. Well, this is someone here with the strength who feels strong attraction for you. They're very passionate about, about you. They are very passionate about you and this connection. But also it feels like this person, they feel that they develop a very, very strong bond with you. Okay, you might be dealing with divine masculine or you are divine masculine, but that em this emperor wants to make an offer of love. Eight of Pentacles with the lovers. This is someone here who wants this connection to work out. Mm -hmm. They do. It feels like you will see an effort from this person's side in order to be with you. The lovers, they want to be with you. They want things to be okay between the two of you. Um, yes, th it's like this person wants to build a strong foundations for this connection to blossom. They want to build a strong relationship with you absolutely page of cups page of wands queen of pentacles eight of cups it feels like this emperor has good intentions um they want to be in touch with you with the page of wands there is something here about them also i feel this person wants to say something or like express uh regarding that distance physical distance that might be between the two of you represented by the eight of cups if that's the case, this person here might tell you, uh, Capricorn, that they are no longer happy or satisfied where they are. And for some of you, this is something to do with their work-related situation. And they might even communicate to you that they are considering leaving their current place of work. 
in order to and actually they are planning maybe to look for something closer to you that's what i am getting okay why because you're a catch with the queen of pentacles that's why capricorn could you please show me this person's feelings towards capricorn Six of Pentacles, Justice, King of Wands, they are planning. This is someone who's planning. You might be dealing with Libra. This person wants to come across as they are sincere, that they are holding very, very high and good standards. Someone who is considerate. Uh, this person here, it's like they, you can trust them with the justice, that they are fair. Six of Pentacles suggests here that this person wants to share a lot with you, okay? And also, this is someone who wants equal give-take. They feel that you are a perfect... Um, they feel that you can be a perfect partner for them, that uh, there is something here about compromise. they feeling that you are the one who is able to compromise to seize them halfway to be on the same page yeah justice king of wands they feel attraction for you big time that king of wands they find you incredibly attractive you know you might be very beautiful handsome very good looking queen of swords but there is something here gosh you might be dealing with sagittarius uh, Capricorn, you might be dealing with Gemini indeed. Um, it's like this person knows that they cannot push their luck because that Queen of Swords is very assertive energy and they feel that way about you, that you are quite assertive and you don't have a problem here to kind of detach or to give someone a cold shoulder. They have respect for you yeah could you please show me this person's actions towards capricorn cross watches the roles can be reversed okay page of pentacles ace of swords This person might be a little bit younger than you for some of you. So we have action. Page of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, Four of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. Ooh. Okay, so you might be dealing with Scorpio, overall energy judgment. There will be a conversation, quite important conversation that will be bring a lot, a lot of truth, uh, clarity, heart to heart conversation here will take place. And I feel that after what you're going to hear from this person, uh, you might actually, I don't know, but it feels like you're going to take a step back in order to rethink and reevaluate what has been said to you or what this person told you knight of pentacles yeah taking things slowly not rushing into things and judgment it's like you will make a decision based on something that will be revealed to you and i feel it will be like okay i need to think about this four of swords taking step back and this making a decision to not rush into things with this person. Why? The world, because of the distance, two of wands and the chariot. Yeah, I feel it is because of the distance. Also traveling, divine timing here. I feel that you want to take things slowly. Maybe this person will tell you that they're going to come to visit you. Or it's like they want to be closer to you. And you might feel like, oh, it's getting a little bit intense. 
I don't know if I am 100% sure that I, you know, maybe because maybe it might be case for some of you that this is a new connection and it's like you just want to get to know this person or, or to spend more time talking to them. Something here regarding action, I feel that you will make a decision that you want to take it slowly or you will make a decision to not rush into things. Interesting. Could you please show me the outcome? Ten of Swords. Okay. The Sun. Okay. And Seven of Cups. High Priestess at the bottom of the deck as an overall energy. For this reading so you might be dealing with pisces we have cancerian energy we have leo with the world we also had aquarius taurus scorpio okay with the temperance sagittarius so we have ten of swords the sun and seven of cups everything will be okay here with the sun because at some point uh, I feel that you will have a dilemma. There is something here about surrounding to the circumstances, but at the same time choosing to, to take things slowly. But with the sun, it feels like, you know, things will be okay because sun is one of the most positive cards in the deck. Seven of cups. Yeah, there is something here about, I don't feel that you've, there is something that this person will tell you and it will raise your eyebrow. And with the seven of cups, yeah, you might feel like, mm, I need to think about this more because Seven of Cups, it's kind of, it's an energy of having choices, but also trying to figure out something. And uh, High Priestess, Unknown, listen to your intuition because you're very intuitive at the moment, Capricorn. Yeah, it's like... Uh, I'm seeing you taking a step back here, Capricorn. Really, and keeping certain things to, to yourself, not talking here much about certain things, not trying to reveal too much, keeping cards very close to your chest with this High Priestess, being very nice, but with the Seven of Cups, it's like, for some of you, it might be a case that you want to keep your options open. It's just as simple as that, and that's fair enough, you know? But at the same time, you might feel like this is all very well, but maybe this person likes to keep their options open. Maybe, you know, this is someone here who might start talking a lot about something else and you might get an impression that they are not making a priority of this connection, that they are focusing here on something else. Yeah, I feel that you don't want confusion. That's what it is. You don't want confusion and the sun brings enlightenment and uh, clarity and certain things coming into light with the sun card so i feel that this person can be a little bit wishy-washy and maybe that's what sort of kind of impression they will make on you you know that's why you will be holding back a little bit but it feels like this person really wants to make an offer of love and they want to put an effort to create a stable and strong relationship with you but I'm seeing your reaction on something that's going to be said to you. For some of you, that conversation will take place within a week or two weeks for some of you. But either way, sooner or later, some sort of heart to heart communication will take place. And I feel you might have a slight change of heart. Can be a case. Things will be OK, but I'm seeing you holding back, at least in the near future. Capricorn. Nevertheless, you have someone who wants to build a very, very solid relationship with you. But you have a free will at the same time. Everybody has a free will. And if some, something feels okay, then fine. But at the same time, you might feel like, you know, there are many layers here. You want to get some, some answers. You want to be sure if this person, uh, you know, deserves your time before jumping into relationship but um, something here will be revealed to you in the near future capricorn 
Capricorn, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly, truly appreciate you. Capricorn, have a fantastic and absolutely gorgeous day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. I am sending you much, much love. Till next time, take care. Bye.